We are up to lesson 23 already. You'll be reading words in no time. Let's say the sounds on our sound wall. M, mm. s, a. Say the phonemes for each letter. M, mm. s, a. Say the letter names. M, s, a. Story time. At the ramp. This story was written by me, actually. Remember to turn the page down the bottom corner and over to the left. You will see some letters being circled. You should recognize those because we have learnt them. M, S and A. At the ramp. Turning the page from the bottom corner. The ramp. I am Sam. Down the bottom right hand corner to turn the page over. I am at the ramp. I am at the pit. And turning over again. Sam is fit. Sam sips at the tap. Sit at the ramp. Now I have some questions for you. Where is Sam? What else does he do at the skate park? Why does he need to be fit? Have you tried skateboarding? That's the end of our story. Let's count the words on each page. Remember that spaces separate words so we can clearly see them. One, two, three, four, five. There are five words on this page. It's your turn. Count the words on this page. I am at the pit. Five words. Search for the letter M, which represents the sound M on these two pages. There are three M's. Did you find them all? Now look for the letter S, which represents the sound S. There is only one S. Did you find it? Lastly, look for the letter A which represents the sound A. Ah. There are three A's. Did you find them? Let's take a closer look at one of the words on the page. Am. You can see the letter A and the letter M. These letters represent phonemes. Remember our sound dots? Let's sound them out. A, m, am, am. Let's look at another word. Sam. You can see the letters S, A, M. Let's say the sounds for these three letters in the word. S, A, M. Mm. Say it faster. Sam. Sam. 
All words are made up of phonemes. They can be at the beginning, they can be at the end, and there's also phonemes in the middle. Touch the sound that begins the word sandwich. Touch the first sound in the word astronaut. Ah. Touch the letter that the word smile begins with. Touch the first letter in the word mermaid. Mm. Say mirror and touch the beginning sound. Mm. Say socks. And touch the letter that begins the word socks. Which letter begins the word ant? Ah. Now we will listen for sounds at the end of a word. Listen, ram. What sound do you hear at the end? Ram. Touch the sound. Mmm. Touch the sound you hear at the end of hiss. Touch the sound you hear at the end of bus. Touch the sound you hear at the end of jam. Mm. Last one. Touch the sound you hear at the end of Sam. Mm. Yesterday you learnt how to write the letter A. The letter A represents the sound A. To write the letter A, We need to start at the top where the starting star is. Place our pencil there and we will go backwards around down to the bottom, turn around and go straight back to the starting spot and then one straight line down. The letter A also has a capital letter A. Remember, they are both named A and they both represent the sound A. Today's activity is a handwriting sheet to learn to write the capital letter A. We begin at the top of the letter where the starting star is. Pencil down and one straight line down. Take your pencil off, go back to the starting star and do a second line straight down. Pencil off and we do one straight line from one side to the other. When we write the capital letter A in the lines, we start at the starting star on the red line. One straight line down to the bottom solid line, pencil off, back to the starting star and another straight line down to the solid bottom line, pencil off and then one straight line across straight through that middle line there. It's time for you to complete your handwriting. 
I will see you in the next lesson.